want you to know that if you do feel some intoxication, it's okay. This isn't dangerous. It will stop eventually and you'll be fine. Here's some things that you can do if you're feeling high and you want to make it go away faster. Lemon zest contains a chemical called limonene, which has been used for a long time as an antidote to the psychoactive effects of THC. You can simply make some lemon zest by grinding the rind of a lemon and having a small amount. Also, chamomile tea is an excellent way to relax and to help you settle down and to relieve some of the psychoactive side effects. I recommend staying comfortable, doing something that feels good like putting on some relaxing music and just waiting because the adverse psychoactive effects will go away eventually. They're non-toxic, they're safe, and they're self-limited. The most disturbing stories about people trying medical cannabis come from those who use edible products that have very high levels of THC and the patient takes too much. One of the interesting things about taking too much cannabis or experiencing a cannabis overdose is that people often report the same symptoms that cannabis tends to relieve when it's used in the correct dosage. These symptoms include nausea, vomiting, dizziness or vertigo, disorientation, anxiety or panic, sometimes an increase of pain, a sense that the body is very heavy, perhaps a racing heart rate, all of these symptoms can be uncomfortable and bothersome, but you should know that if you take too much THC-dominant cannabis, it is not going to hurt you or damage you permanently. THC is non-toxic, even in very high doses. So while you may have some discomfort, you're not going to damage your organs, you're not going to have any serious injury or risk of adverse long-term effect. Stay hydrated and just wait it out. You're going to get through it. You'll be okay.